right, Professor Liu is going to teach you how to do 06 Word Module 2 project. This is your second project. Uh, it's due on September 27. Okay, you click on the title of the project and click on um, your link to your uh, to your uh, send system. At this moment, you probably have your uh, 14 days uh, trial account. So you open this course, go to trial account. Uh, after you have the access code, you register here or you purchase from here to get access code. Okay, let's open the course right now. All right, so I started. All right. So I need to have my instruction file and I want to make sure I'm in the right spot. Okay, instruction file here. Okay, so I already have a cancel. Then I'm, I need to my uh, student file right here. All right, so uh, here, uh, test student here. All right, so let's do it right now. So for this, I'm coming to my document. All right, so uh, my project two right here, and uh, let's uh, open my instruction file, okay? And uh, let me do the page width. Okay, so so these uh, project two uh, mainly is talk about uh, how do you uh, how do you create a short research paper during the two years you are at a college. There are many opportunity you need to find. You need to write research paper. And the research paper has a uh, fixed rules and guidelines, either MLA or APA. Um, junior college at two years college, most likely we use MLA. So for this assignment, we are going to practice using the MLA style. You're going to learn how to insert uh, <coughs> citation, bibliography, and all these style thing to learn how to do your uh how to do your own research paper so this is a very important uh project okay i hope you uh will enjoy it okay so uh oh sorry this one need to close all right so now let's go open now our uh uh <clears throat> start out file so make sure your start out file you always say file save as and it has to be under uh, underscore two, okay? Uh, same is very picky. If you don't do that, well, you are going to get, uh, well, not to get points, okay? All right, so we have uh, our uh, instruction, uh, generational marketing, and uh, we already changed our one to two. And we're going to do this right now. So first, you are writing a research paper for your marketing principal class. The topic of the paper is generational marketing. All right, you must write the paper in MLA style. All right, so first we have to clear, very clear, say we're going to use MLA style. All right, whenever you do research paper, you go to reference. Reference has most of the thing you need to do add a, a research paper. So we want MLA. That was make clear right now. MLA style. All right, so file save. So we are in the right track right now. We are going to do MLA style. As soon as we know we are going to do MLA style. Then in the MLA style, all right, so there are some, um, you know, and normal style. 
All right, so even the normal style has a little bit different based on different publisher and the requirement by the teacher. For this one, the normal style is Times New Roman. All right, the, when you need to do your research paper, it will tell you clearly what kind of uh, uh, font they want and uh, size they want and what kind of space they want. And you don't want to constantly change all the time. You want to change your normal style. So means you want to provide a standard style for entire your MLA. So what what we're going to do it right now, okay? So that's what we plan to do. So we coming back right here. And now you have to go back to home because home has your uh, other style, okay? That's your normal style, okay? Add on your normal style here, all right? So basically, we need to modify, okay? Now we're going to modify this right now, okay? So first, modify these as Times New Roman 12, okay? That's the first thing. And then, all right, our line spacing is double. Our line spacing is double, so let's go to formats right here, okay? Is in the paragraph, guys. And uh, line spacing is double. All right, and uh, double and after, after the spacing, no, no, it's zero, okay? It say that uh, with no blank space after the paragraph. So I basically need to change that to zero and hit up, apply and hit OK. All right, so basic that 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 is uh what they want right now okay we fix already okay we fix already all right uh so apply the modified normal style to the first four paragraph in the document from li bao to a set uh basic already apply already and they they do it for us so you okay so uh this is your new normal style okay so we uh, we do this and we uh, update the normal to the uh, match selection all right so we uh, hold up we did it okay so we that we did that already then we are going to continue make our a research paper to be uh, more professional so next our research paper right here say hmm all right so hmm uh, generational marking that's your uh, title uh, usually title is center okay so we come in here we learn that okay this line need to be center okay we got it right now let's continue all right so then we continue then we will uh, come here okay so after that and uh, I need a header, okay? A research paper always have header. On the header is a blank header and dry a line and put your last name and this person is about. You put your own last name and uh, with a space and insert a, a plan number and the number from the current position gallery, something like that, okay? Then close the header and footer tools, okay? All right, so gentlemen, let's do it right now. We're coming back here. All right, so we are here right now. So in the order to do that, I have to say insert, okay? And now uh, coming back here, uh, I say insert um, mm, header, okay? So blank header right here. All right, right here, and I gotta go back to home because it tell me I need to write a line. So write a line here and let's type right now. First, you type uh, this person's last name. You usually do your own, okay? Mm, wow. Then space. Now, now I need to insert a what? I need to insert a uh, line, uh, page number. So insert right now. Uh, right here is a page number, right? So let's go to a page number. Make sure you have a space, okay? Then page number. So the page number at the current position and is a plan number, no fancy, okay? 
So now we done right now. All right. So now, uh, when I finish this, uh, header and this, so I close header and a uh, footer, uh, tool right now. I come back to the main thing. It's okay. All right. So now I'm going to go to my, uh, next here. All right. Basically, on your MLA style, <clears throat> entire uh document need to be first line intent. Okay. And so we need to do that. Okay. So that's MLA style. So we select all these blah blah blah. All right to here. Okay. So all these paragraph we select it. All right. Once we select it, then we will we want it to be uh first line intent and it the thing is in the paragraph, okay? So it's in the paragraph, okay? Then is intention and they say in the first line okay and 0 0.5 inches okay so that's what they want then you say huh okay all right so now you fix your paragraph as MLA style right now all right so now let's do this um here we show your teacher gave you some instruction your teacher uh here is Nancy Tokai. Mm -hmm. All right. So <clears throat> teacher gave you some professor Nancy Tokai. You want to re respond to Nancy Tokai because uh, this uh, MLA may be, uh, especially if a research paper or to a master or research, you, you need to have uh, more than one communication with your instructor. So so you, you want to respond to comments in the first paragraph. So read a comment and delete it. And you want to follow what teacher want. The teacher actually want you add this group, blah, blah, blah here, insert a citation to a new source. Okay. So new source like this way. Mm -hmm. Okay. So that's coming back right here. All right. So we uh, read the teacher say. So let's go to comments right here. The read the teacher say, uh, you might need to write a source for the information. It is quite common to knowledge. Okay, fine. Right now, so I am going to delete it. Okay. So once I delete it, now I understand. I I need to add a citation. I know what teacher want us to do, right? Add a citation, right? So when you add a citation you need to know this you want to add before the period before the period okay so i my insertion point you see that before the period and i want to do this okay reference everything is reference about uh, writing a research paper i'm sorry so then you want to insert uh um now you want to um uh insert a uh citation okay so insert citation and it's really a new new source okay so right here and you want to do the uh, web page is website and uh right and this one is called pew research center All right, so these are the information provided by your instruction sheet, and you say okay. All right, so now make sure you save it. So uh, keep the work you just did it, then we'll continue. 
So next, uh, we are going to do this right now. So uh, we're going to insert an uh, 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 existing citation at the end of sentence, like campaign design, uh, designer segment and something before the period. Okay, so let's come here, right here. All right, so before the period, uh, guys, gentlemen, remember it's before the period, the before the period. Okay, right before the period. Then I need to, um, uh, I'm in a reference, right? I'm gonna insert citation here. Um, this time, I wanted is a uh, uh, Chesterfield, so I'm coming here. All right, so this is how you add a uh, existing uh, citation. So okay. Now let's continue right now. Let's go to uh, step nine. Step nine is a same sentence right here. Uh, we wanted to use the customize and use the last formal word. We start with T. All right. So same thing here. We're coming back right here. Cut the customize here. All right. So you right click it and go to uh, cinema, uh, cinemas, and we want to use uh, starting with T is uh, Taylor. Okay, so we finish start with T right now. All right, so let's go to the fourth paragraph right now. So one, two, one, two, three, four, fourth paragraph. Okay, so in the fourth paragraph here, and we find out the citation is this citation here, and we really need to add it source okay so right here it tell you that <clears throat> so you go to the uh, fourth uh, body paragraph and in the research citation added the source to two to the day access all right so we do what they want right now and we are going to add it source so the day access is two september 2nd so you hit okay all right, now uh, you learn this now in the same paragraph, okay, in the same paragraph, all right, before this one here, <laughs> all right, so before the period of another, uh, this, this, this paragraph, another something, and we want it to have a new cita citation, it has a new source, okay, then uh, based on the information they provided right here okay so we're going to have another citation right here another citation uh, insert new source and before the uh, period okay so this is another new citation right here all right we got it right now so we coming back here uh, we already at the right spot right here so we insert a citation and that is a new source so let's type the new source right now this time is article in a periodical So that the information provided by your step 11, say hit OK. So we done for this one right now. Then we are coming to do the next one right here. So we are going to go to next uh, paragraph, fifth paragraph. There's a citation is Vince citation. We're going to just add it add the 14 as page let's see how do you add it that okay let's see how do you so we come into the veins here and 
we're going to edit citation. We don't edit source, edit citation, and we add the page as what? 14. Okay, and hit OK. So we add edit citation here. All right, so uh, we are going to uh, to provide additional information at the end of fifth paragraph. Move the insertion point immediately, immediately after the period of the sun. All right, so now, now here is the list and after period, after the period, okay, not before period, after period, okay. So what happened is we're going to add a full note. So the full note is after the period, okay. So the insertion point, one more time, is insertion point is after, uh, is after the period of the sentence. So let's do it right now. Make sure it's reference and insert full note. And the full note you're going to type is this at Alright, so notice we already change our style, normal style, but not the full notes. So we really need to continue to modify the full note text style to become 12 and line spacing is double and the indent 0 0.5. Okay, so that will match the other format we did. So we coming back right here and then uh, first of all, that's coming back to home. Home will uh, easily teach you, uh, easily to get these. All right, so 12, okay? 12. All right, and then uh, the spacing here uh, is um, double. Yeah, yeah, let me see. All right, so that spacing is double. All right, all right. Then uh, first line in then is zero point five. So this match to your uh, the main uh, uh, part. Okay, so we done that right now, and we go back to our main paragraph. Main. All right. So let's go to fifteen right here. Fifteen. Okay, fifteen in the main body of document. All right. So all the customer is going to replace by consumer, okay? So we are coming back here, all right? And we find a uh, customer. Whenever we find customer, there are two, okay? And we're going to replace by consumer. All right, we will replace by consumer. Replace all, we have two replacement okay so once we finish that we can close this right now all right so we did some you know uh find and replace okay now next right now we're going to page two right now page two and we're going to see uh another uh comment from instructor page two uh teacher told us something we replace it thanks okay so we're coming back here uh, this is a teacher say this is a very interesting finding. We tell the teacher thanks with the exclamation. All right, so that's the reply you give to your teacher. All right, uh, then we're going to go to the uh, work site. Okay, so first of all, MLA style. Okay, you need to understand. MLA style worksite is an, another page. Okay, so you need to insert a uh, manually have a page break. Then also worksite should be centered. That's MLA style. You, you know you need to get used to it. That's a rule anyway. So word site. All right. So insert a uh, a page break. Not only that, it has to be centered. Uh, remember this MLA style. All right, so 
Now I'm going to press N to the left right here. Okay, ready to next one here right now. All right, so work side, you, you're going to insert all the BBL roughly. Okay, so right here. So for reason work side, all the thing you cited has to be insert right there. So eh, at least you don't want to retype. Okay, it's a system already keep those for you. Uh, you, you need to just uh, let the system uh, display it for you because uh, you don't want to make a mistake, easy to make a mistake. So we coming back right here, we say here. And then now I go reference and I go bibliography and the last one insert bibliography. So they insert all for you right now. Okay. In the right format, okay. The done by the system, not the best. You really don't want to do anything by yourself. Easy to make mistake. All right. So now we're going to do this, right? Let's go to um find out these. Uh, this have missing year. Everybody has twenty twenty. This uh Schwabell doesn't have the year. So we need to come back to Schwabell, okay? So it's right here. All right. So I have to actually add this source. And I add this source right here. I need to add 2020. All right, 2020, add it. So I fixed right here right now, but I need to make it update to your, uh, you already copy those citation. You need to update it. Okay, so you update it. So as soon as you update it, you can check your short bell has 2020 here okay so you can see here it tell you that oh okay after after you add 2020 can you update we update right now okay now last job is always review uh, last job is always review before you submit it you always need to review the so-called review will be spelling check no one is that good okay so online okay we change to online right now all right all right so now we done okay now we save it we are ready to upload so i'm going to close it i'm coming back to my side right here oh sorry all right so I continue and I upload. Hmm. All right, so I ready to submit, huh? So I submit it. All right, so. I'm going to view my <clears throat> report. I better save it first, okay? Uh, in the zero 06. And I open it up right here. Gee, I still get 90 out of 100. Let me see what's wrong. I did it. Uh, uh, now I did not delete. You need to resolve. You need to click resolve. Okay. Insert the full note. I did the full note already. Hmm. Okay. Uh, the full note I did not modify good or already. Uh, so anyway. That's my uh, project. Uh, then I hope uh, uh, this video uh, help you and I hope you like it. Okay, so 